Uh, of course, we're talking a lot about variants, uh, and we're uh, we're working uh, in making sure that we uh, delay as the mo as m uh, we delay uh, the entry of the variants in the, the Montreal territory. We're talking about three variants uh, that are of concern for health, care, uh, health authorities, uh, and we know that those variants uh, are more transmittable. And for the UK variants, we also have data that, that show us that they are more, they, they cause more severe forms of the illness. Um, at the time we're speaking, we have nine uh, cases of variants that have been confirmed uh, with uh, a sequencement by the Laboratoire de Santé Publique, but we also have 23 uh, presumptive cases that have been declared uh, by uh, some laboratories, but that are not confirmed at the time uh, we, uh, we are speaking. Uh, for those suspected suspected cases, uh, we have a high correlation with the, the confirmation by uh, le sequencement, so we're treating them as if they were confirmed cases in the way we're uh, intensifying our uh, intervention. So what we're doing, of course, is uh, to delay uh, the entry of this variance and delay the, uh, what we do not want is that the variants be the principal uh, 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 virus that is circulating in the community. So what we're doing, of course, is surveillance. Uh, when we do our tracing, we're more uh, intense and aggressive. So we're uh, looking at, we're searching of contacts and contacts of contacts, and we're going on the backward tracing, uh, looking at the, the index cases and their contacts also. And of course, if the variance is associated with a uh, um, uh, a school or a kindergarten, a daycare center or, or a workplace, we're going to go with uh, massive screening and uh, we may have to uh, close more rapidly classes or schools. Uh, so uh, this is what we're doing as public health authority to delay the entry of the variants in our territory. But I think uh, I have a message also for the population. Uh, even though we have reopened some uh, commerce, uh, some businesses, uh, and uh, and some activities, outdoors activities, and I think we we need it. So uh, we have to maintain eye vigilance, uh, reduce our contacts maintain uh, distanciation the two meters. Uh, of course, if you have symptoms, do not uh, go rapidly get your test, do not go to work, do not send your child uh, to uh, school or uh, daycare center. Uh, and of course, uh, while we're gonna, we have, we have to protect uh, elders, knowing that we're going to be able to vaccinate them soon. Uh, so of course, do not, uh, uh, well, uh, do not uh, visit your uh, elders or, or uh, ask them to babysit your child, for, ex for example. So I think we still have a couple of weeks ahead of us where we have to be uh, solid air uh, and, um, and uh, vigilant. Thank you. Can you uh, just tell us again in English what the situation is with variants uh, in Montreal now? And can you tell us as much as possible about the actual locations on the island you've said? Uh, there is one school in Outremont that has um, a presumed case. Um, what other details can you give us? First of all, how many altogether <coughs> presumed variant, variant cases are there? Um. Of course, uh, as I said, uh, some of the presumptive cases are still in investigation, so I have a partial information at the time we're speaking. Um, at the time we're speaking, we have nine cases that are confirmed by sequençage at the LSPQ, 23 that are uh, presumed or presumptive cases that have been declared by uh, one laboratory in uh, Montreal that is able to do the, the criblage, and 12 cases that are um, by uh, epidemiological, well, epidemiological link, so it's uh, secondary cases of uh, confirmed cases. Um, most of the case, the first cases that we had were uh, 
around uh, households or families, uh, so they did not uh, produce secondary cases uh, out of this uh, f the family circle. Uh, but we had a, a, a beginning of an outbreak in one school um, that um, was linked uh, to uh, when we look at the the index cases, we found out that it was one of uh, our suspected cases. So this is our, our the first outbreak that we are seeing. But we will we we send the specimen for sequenceage to uh, to confirm that is it is really linked uh, to uh, the variant the UK variant. And the school at the time we're speaking is closed, uh, and uh, we uh, we we sent uh, the. Uh, the professors uh, and the students for a screening test. It was for two weeks. Yeah. Uh, yes, it, it's it's closed, but I think it's it still has one week to go. Uh, 